Jitender Sang Shanti stares at death every day. He runs a service in Delhi that transports and cremates bodies for free on pyres like this, according to Hindu tradition. On the deadliest day so far, more than 3,000 people died in India. पर इस बार जो कोरोना हुआ है, उन छोटे-छोटे बच्चों की लाशों को देखा जब मैंने, और बहुत ही जवानी की उम्र में विधवा हुई बहनों को देखा मैंने, क्योंकि जो अभी मरे हैं सब बेमौत मरे हैं। Jitender has been doing this for 25 years, but he never imagined this. सच बात है कि आजकल तो मैं दो घंटे भी नहीं सोता। this crematorium used to receive 10 bodies a day. Now it's seeing up to 90 bodies on average. It's so crowded that sometimes people have to wait for hours to cremate their family members or even return the next day. Many Hindu burial customs are also impossible right now, but Jitender is doing his best to honor the dead. But even the basics, like wood, are running out. Usually, cremation costs 5,500 rupees, or 74 U.S. dollars. But Jitender's organization is doing it for free, relying on donations. It takes about six hours for a body to turn to ashes. Family members collect and immerse them in the Ganges River. To date, more than 200,000 have died in India from COVID-19. But experts say the official tally likely underestimates the actual toll in the nation of 1.3 billion people. And COVID, I saw a shot in COVID, that my father's last time was in front of me, and my children had told me that I wouldn't do this, I would be scared. So people were like that, who didn't come from a genuine way. They were body quarantined, they were quarantined in the house. They were taking care of the undertaking, they were taking care of it. With a heavy, nearly impossible workload, Jitender never forgets that each body represents a whole life. I He worries about his own loved ones too. In the last wave, his whole family was infected. He was in serious condition, and one of his drivers died. And seeing death day after day has taken its toll on Jatender. Oxygen.